Thanks for coming to our channel. It's taken a while to make this second video, but here we are in front of the Claude Allen Tobacco Factory in Milton. It's a almost hot day in August. Um, we're here to uh, begin a second uh, series of videos, and we want to everybody to, at least if you can, look below and hit like and subscribe if you want to but we hope this will be uh be, these will be coming more regularly more regularly definitely regularly is the key word uh, yeah but yes this is a big project we've been working on along with yancey smith and the milton preservation and beautification society the factory over here is the last one that's standing, not only in Milton, but the last one standing in Caswell County, and it was built post-Civil War era, and we have recently been awarded a grant for $15,000 from the Marion Stedman Covington Foundation in Greensboro, North Carolina, and we've recently applied to the Community Foundation of the Dan River Region, and we hope to be successful with that. But we did have an interesting visit by the Danville Historical Society a couple of weeks ago, and we'll show you some footage from that and also um, staff from the North Carolina Agriculture Commission also paid a visit here a few weeks ago, and that was a fantastic meeting as they knew more about plug tobacco operations than we did, and they were able to show us um, some things about that. But it's the dream to have this restored and open to the public so you could see what a small factory was like back in the 1800s. We also have a couple of old photographs of the factory taken maybe 25 years ago that uh, might be interesting. It's deteriorated some since then, but we have the plans ready and drawn up, engineered, approved plans to start the reconstruction and re restoration, uh, beginning with the foundation and making sure it's tight and sturdy, safe for people to walk in. Uh, but anyway, uh, Please, again, if you watch these videos that we're going to show you today uh, and like them, uh, please hit like below and subscribe. We need some subscribers and we uh, want to continue these if we can. And thank you very much. Now for the rest of the video.
better price. So he's gonna take down those five. Look at there! Woohoo! <laughs> Cody with the Danville Historical Society, and we had the great privilege to come out today and meet Angela and a few other natives of Milton, North Carolina, to look at the plug tobacco warehouse that's standing in front of us. It is an amazing building that I think needs to be preserved at all costs. Uh, it's very interesting interior, something that you wouldn't really expect from the outside. It has original bins in here from the days of the plug tobacco warehouse plus the original molasses bins where they mix the tobacco together. We just explored Joe and myself, who's off to the side of the camera, the underside of this building. It needs some structural repairs, which are significant, but it has a lot of things that have been preserved and thrown under here for who knows how many decades. Uh, there are some original stair treads. We just relocated an original stair spindle that's in here. So this building definitely deserves to be saved and preserved for future preservation. That's all I can say about it at this point. <laughs> Thanks so much, Cody. Absolutely. You're welcome. Please know the factory is not ready for visitors. It is very dangerous, so please do not attempt to enter. Thanks for watching the video. Thanks to everybody who helped with the project. If you enjoyed it, please feel free to share it with your friends. Thank you.